What is going on my mates? Hope your Thursday has been absolutely outstanding so far. I just want to give a quick shout out to Infinity on Hannah. I was in one of her most recent videos titled Concert Diaries. I talk about how I met Joe Taylor randomly at Anaheim Strip Mall. So if you want to go see that dude, I'll put it right down here. Hey, what's up dude? So I know you're really, really into music. So I was just kind of wondering your thoughts on the newest title fight record. New title fight dude, are you effing serious? I mean like their newest record, Hyperview. What do you think of it? Oh. Where in the effing hecking F is title fight, dude? Where? Where? Where are they, dude? Where? I'm gonna beat you up, dude. So you know when a child gets kidnapped? Horrible, right? Well, this is worse. This is worse. Obviously, I'm kidding. Obviously, this is much worse. So, Title Fight is a band from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. They formed in the year of 2003, so about 28 years ago. And they haven't been around, dude. Where have they been? I've been missing them, my mate. I just... I they, they just fell off the plate the, they just fell off the face of the earth i haven't heard from them in in so long where, where were they even last seen i think they may have played a show this year but ever since then no one knows dude that's concerning title fight is an indie band that infuses jazz to create an incredibly unique sound that no one has ever done before and i'm only saying this because i want you to correct me about it in the comments and help this video get more engagement i know a lot of people are gonna say dude they have other projects going on they have other stuff that they're doing ned is in this band called glitter they're sick i agree but it's not title fight dude it ain't title fight where the f is title fight i know i may get some comments saying nate dude they've been in pants since 2003 i hope you know that and i do know that and some of you may be saying dude maybe they are burnt out and and i get it dude but see you you have to understand that i'm really really selfish and just want them to keep being a band and making basically the same records over and over again with you know a little bit of progression with each one but but that's what i want dude that's it but on the real though my mates let's let's just get like s r s for a second and i and i do just want to say that title fight is genuinely one of my favorite favorite bands and i have been missing their presence in this this general this general scene that we're in you know what i mean they, they just had this presence before they they just brought something to the table that no other band did their merch game was fire their packaging was fire and by that i mean just just their overall look dude they were so punk dude they were just oh, i love them so much dude one thing that i particularly loved about title fight that not a lot of bands can pull off in the way that they did is that as they grew in their career got on more legitimate labels, gained more fans, put out more albums, and just grew in general. Somehow, they were still able to just almost effortlessly maintain this DIY punk aesthetic, but also also kind of like, it's almost like they're kind of walking on a tightrope between like being like super professional, corporate label, whatever, and then like the DIY punk, we do everything ourselves. And, and I just don't know how they did it, dude. I just loved it so, so much. And I honestly don't know what they're up to, but I hope to see them soon. Title Fight has put out some outstanding albums Albums in the past five to ten years in 2009 they put out an amazing compilation slash EP slash whatever you want to call it called the last thing you forget it's just pop punk it's punk it's got a little bit of emo if you've never heard their song symmetry go listen to it it's amazing that was great they followed that up with shed in 2011 and then played the Vans warp tour and then they just went in 2015, they released an album called Hyperview, which I didn't care for a lot, but hey, it was still Title Fight, and I jammed it, and I jam it sometimes still, but there's there's an album that they released in 2012 that is on my top 25 albums of all time list that has been on that list for nearly six years now, and that album is called Floral Effing Green. By the way, you're not allowed to listen to Title Fight unless you cuff your pants and wear flannels and wear light wash jeans. I don't think that my words alone could ever convey just how good this album is, so I'm going to do two things. Number one, one, I'm gonna ask you to go listen to it if you never have. Number two, I'm gonna read some lyrics from that album because that was a huge selling point for me. Obviously the music was too, but the lyrics were just so, so good. I'll be reading lyrics from four different tracks as well as one bonus lyric read from their EP titled Spring Songs. So here we go. Bad luck never leaves. Your jinx just floats around like the taste inside your mouth or the sound when your skull cracks. Feel the growing pains. It means you're growing up too fast, telling white lies to black cats stretch me out across the tracks i feel lost feel boring i've been caught sleeping all morning i feel scared of knowing i'm just a single leaf 
and the wind blowing. Can't fight this feeling of death when it wraps its hands around your neck like the pill that's underneath your tongue. Swallow it with a soft regret and all the things that make you cry. Remembering you'll watch your parents die and all the people that you love in your life find their way above the Irem Shrine. Basically, you'll just watch everyone you, you love die. Great. Everything's so uncertain. Can't find the right direction. You look in the mirror and tell me you see clear. I lie, say I can see me, but I just can't get past this feeling. I talk, but no one listens. Can't make my own decisions. I just want to hear the words you speak when I'm not around. What do you think? I think I'm hopeless. I think I think too much. Bruised and broken, covered up with blush. Ah! Okay, dude, here's the thing. I love Title Fight, and I don't know where they've been or where they are. If they're safe, if they're still alive. I don't know that, dude. You probably don't either. So here's the point. I love Title Fight. I miss them, and I just wanted to talk about how much I effing love them. Thank you mates so much for watching this video and just listen to me talk about how much I love this effing band called Title Fight. If you've never listened to Title Fight, dude, just go effing do it. Like, come on. But, um, subscribe if you haven't, my mates. We're going freaking crazy lately. I love y'all so much. Hope you have an outstanding rest of your day. Freaking mates club forever. One more time. Mates club forever. I love y'all so much, and I'll catch y'all tomorrow.